Oftentimes, that perfect photo you took needs to be either cropped or resized when it is time to actually use it. With the click of a few buttons on the Edit tab of Photopad, your perfect image will truly be perfect. Click the Crop button on the toolbar to open the Crop options in the Effects, History and Layers panel. Enter a custom aspect ratio in pixels in the Set Size text boxes. If you want a freeform crop, deselect the Keep Aspect Ratio box. If you want to maintain the proportions, make sure that it is checked. Select a preset ratio from the drop-down menu, such as 1x1 one one for a square, or 4x5 to prepare that landscape from last year's vacation to print on a 16x20 canvas. As you can see, the rectangular presets activate the landscape and portrait buttons so that you can set the picture orientation. When you are happy with the crop, click the Apply button. You can always use the Edit button to make adjustments, the Reset button to start over, or click the X in the upper right corner to remove the crop completely. Pictures will display better on the web and also print better if they are properly sized. Click the Resize button on the toolbar to view the options in the Effects, History and Layers panel. I recommend checking the Keep Aspect Ratio checkbox to avoid distorting your image. Use the Units drop-down menu to make your adjustments in pixels, inches, millimeters, or as a percentage. When you are making adjustments in millimeters or inches, you also have the option to adjust the resolution by changing the number in the pixels per inch or the pixels per millimeter box. The Liquid Resize tool resizes an image while preserving its contents. This gives you the ability to resize an image without cropping out important areas. This image with the subject in the center and the landscape in the background is a perfect example. However, as you can see in this picture that has the subject filling the frame, it isn't a good solution. For more PhotoPad tutorials, visit the address shown on your screen.